Hello everyone, I am the Grand Cat and welcome back. Third video in a row today because of the Codebreaker event. And we have got our rewards. And there we are. Rank 562. We shall claim. And there he is. There is Big Ezekiel with his single leg Boston Crab. And let's train him up and see how he is. So new star discovered, of course. That was me looking at the uh, the previous one that I got, where there was 68. Yeah, the previous, um, that wasn't Codebreaker though, that was... Something else. <laughs> I have forgotten. Um, trainable. That's easier. And let's get him all the way up to level 100. We can use some of these. In fact, actually... Um, let's look at all, because we've got a few things here. So I'm looking for things that are high level like this. That brings them up to level 93. I think we can find something similar to that. I'm trying not to use the stars because I'm trying to use those because anything that's prod has double the points, which is good for the spring fusions. So I'm trying not to use those, but I'm trying to find anything else that has some levels in it because that will be worth more. I can get rid of that, that's pretty useless. Get rid of this run microphone and this and this as well. Does that take us up to 100? There we go. So at level 100, we have. Well, the Charisma is actually the strongest one. Charisma is 37.43, power coming in second at 37.41. And then you have the weaker ones, the speed is the third, which is 37.38, and the weakest is toughness, which is 37.34. And if we go to swap image, you can see that you can indeed swap it to any of the images of Elias. Um, which is rather hilarious. Um, it just shows, they know, they're well aware of what they're doing. But the original drifter. But I think we're going to keep it with Ezekiel. I think that's maybe the best one to go with. And let's give him an equipment. So has equipment. We're going to look at Shinsuke Nakamura. I'm going to take this off of you and we're going to give it to Ezekiel. Oh, well, actually, let's see where Ezekiel stands. So Ezekiel untrained, he is just weaker than Austin Theory. But... Once he's got those 100 wins in, he should be a little bit stronger. We're going to give him that equipment as well. And that equipment should be one of the best equipments. And also that makes a fantastic pairing. Um, the 562 Ezekiel with the 380 Cody Rhodes. And one's up arrow and one's down arrow. So that should be very very strong very strong little tag team so and of course he is immediately stronger than the fortified one urban archeister which was the next strongest card and the fortified one dolph ziggler not quite as strong as urban archeister but he is stronger than orton and riddle in fact actually he doesn't have any equipment Let's check our Runner Shyster. So if we remove this, then just make sure. Yeah, okay, our Runner Shyster is still stronger. I just wanted to check that. And our Runner Shyster is using the strongest equipment we have. So there we have it, folks. So there is Big Ezekiel himself with his massive, massive stats. He's going to be quite strong uh, once he gets trained up. I'm going to put him into the deck as well because he will be stronger than 
uh, Austin Theory. <laughs> I forgot I forgot Austin Theory's first name there. I was just going to call him Theory. I know the WWE is only calling him Theory, but I'm um, like, you know, I I like remembering people's other names that they have forgotten. You know, like Antonio Cesaro or um, oh my goodness, I've forgotten Rusev's name. How? Oh, Rusev did have a name. Alexander Rusev, that's it. <laughs> There's a few characters um, that have had two names and then have uh, been reduced down to one, unfortunately. So, Austin Theory is the latest of those. And thankfully, Cody Rhodes has managed to keep both of his names. But Ezekiel is down to just one. But then Elias was just one as well. So, there we go, folks. That is our big Ezekiel. And that is him, 562. And he's pretty, pretty strong. But one last thing. Let's just check. Catalog and names. And Elias. Yeah, okay. So he's always been an Aparo. And the Driftway has always given power and charisma. And charisma has always been stronger than power. So... Um, Ezekiel is the same stats as Elias. I just hadn't thought about that until just there, but there you go. Okay, well that is it for this video, folks. Once again, thank you all for watching. If you liked it, give us a like, share and subscribe. Leave a comment below for a chance at winning a prize worth £100. And if you are not subscribed, please click that subscribe button. Click the notification icon to see when more of these videos go up. And if you want to help out the channel, best way to do that is check out some of our other videos on the WWE Supercard playlist as well. So thank you all very much for watching, and we will see you all in the next video. Goodbye, everybody.